Trucker here. Welcome to my channel. I hope you enjoy it. So, we got Bob Hoyle from Chemex over here. I'm just here to be helpful, man. I'm not looking for no attention. Well, I needed some help cleaning this, so that's why I called him over here. So what do you got here, Bob? It's just the awesome sauce, man. That's You know what I do with this. No, it's I don't It's for the know. little touch-ups, right? Look over here. So the water, you know, you get the, yeah. the little bit of minerals from the water left in there, and okay. you know, I come back in and I just hit it with this. All right. It's just a little bit of a touch-up thing. And it, like you it. know, it's nice because it doesn't leave anything behind, you know? It's a little bit of something. It's just something I use on the bugs right, and the right. water spots, you know, right. just to get a little bit of uh, tune-up. So at a place like this, you know, today, you know, you, you got a lot of little things you want to make look just perfect, especially down here at eye level. Yeah. So I figured, you know, this would be helpful. This See all that in there? Yeah, yeah. So, you know, well, now it goes we all the way up. up there. You know, oh, to be honest, you, that's the one place I didn't dry. Oh, but you can reach up there. So that's the thing. That's what you this can. Is for. Yeah. So. Oh no way. Well, that's why we got this. Is this like this a homemade is, deal? No, no, no. These are real. You sell those? Yeah, these are real. Here, trade you. Hold on to that. There. Right there. So this is a mid on a stick. I yeah, love so it. This is a plush material, but they make a bunch of different heads for it. Yeah. So you can use it for whatever you want. But you get up there, and oh, now you got look your at reach. That. Can you reach the stack too? No kidding. Oh my god. Dude, it's, Bob. it's enough to get you excited a little bit. Um, dude, you hear me? I'm getting excited. <laughs> when, you're, when, you're done, uh, when you're done washing and, and stuff. Yeah. Uh, oh, I gotta get that. Mid on a stick. We have the dreadnought drying covers for the mid on a stick. Oh. Now I'm I'm eight foot seven, okay. so that's a helpful part of it. Actually, you know what the key is? They make extra sections for these. Okay. So you can make this longer. They normally come one section shorter. This What's one of these go for? Uh, they sell for like 79 bucks. Totally worth it. And then it. the covers are like 10 bucks for oh, yeah. But I just, I brought a bunch of them because I knew it would be helpful. You know, there's always You can just walk around and do these, this all day. We're these just these hanging my, out doing that these actually. These are my favorite. What are those? They're roller rags. Oh, nice. So they're microfiber rags that are like paper towel roll. Just, just tear them oh, off as really? they go. Oh, really? Those are helpful. Yeah, I'll trade you one more time. We'll get that thing back here. These are my favorite thing. Uh, thank you for letting me tune up your truck, man. You know how Yeah, yeah, this that. is, uh, you know, this is going to be a Chemex video. You know, <laughs> we won't even monetize. This will be a separate video. Oh, now, man. for people who don't know who Chemex is, every time I'm truck washing, I say, I'm using Liquid X. This is the guy right here. These yeah, are the people Liquid right X. here. Yeah, this is where we get the Liquid X soap from. Made in Agawam, man. In Agawam, Massachusetts. Yeah. This is Bob Hoyle. And Bob, you got your own YouTube channel, don't yeah, you? Yeah, ChemX, C H E M X. I hear it's doing pretty well. We're doing all right over there. You're doing all right. Yeah, you're doing pretty good. Yeah, we're doing pretty good. Yeah, we're doing pretty good. and yeah, washers. We we're not conventional yeah. by any means. That's yeah, yeah. Sure. <laughs> we get it done. We get it done though, and we have a lot of fun with it. But yeah, we just try and bring in people who have dirty trucks and send them out clean. You know. Yep. Sometimes they show up clean and we send them out dirtier. I yeah. don't know. <laughs> you know, like we had all these people yesterday with all the, everybody was parked out front. Yeah. Jason Sanders, uh, yeah. Brett from Canada Chrome Shop, uh, Skillex, they were all. Oh yeah. In. Oh my God. I was afraid about making. I wouldn't want to wash that truck. Dude, I was afraid. Yeah. I was like, oh no, we're gonna make a mess out of this thing. Did you wash that truck? Yeah, we washed all three of them. Wow, you did, they, you do a good job then, because uh, they came out all right. They, they came out real nice. Brett what are from, those? Oh, that's a nice. Canada yeah. Chrome shop used our stars and stripes because he didn't want to touch the paint, so we did touchless on that. Yeah. Yeah, that cap over was no contact. Came out. Fantastic. Wow. Well, it wasn't that dirty. It helps. Yeah. So it's not that dirty. Yeah, you're the no contact soap guys. <laughs> I guess so. Yeah. You know, I mean, especially that's that really comes in handy in the winter time. Well, yeah, for the salt and saving a little time when it's cold yep. outside. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. There you go, what do you think of that? Dude, looks beautiful. I have two stacks though. Oh yeah, well yeah. That, you want us to I'll get it even I mean, more, I, you know. Yeah. Bob, 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 can you show them how it works twice? Oh, okay, yeah. yeah, I'll show yeah. them how it works twice. Okay. Yeah. Let's go. So how you been otherwise? You I'm doing been? great. Yeah, I just got back from Italy. Really? I was in Italy and Spain last week on vacation oh. with a family. Did a little cruise out of Barcelona. So what do you think? You recommend Italy or what? Absolutely, dude. It's amazing. That's got to be a nice trip, huh? Oh, jealous. dude, that looks, that's stuff. That looks great, yeah. But it's all right. It's okay. You know what you should try out? What's that? I've got a new polish that we're coming out with. Okay. I'm going to name it Bandit Blue. Nice. You, Bandit wanna, Blue. you want a little bit of that? Of course. Let's see what you think of that. I'll give it to you. I don't have a label for it yet. Okay, I'll try it out. But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to release that soon. I got it's some a, things I can polish on there. It's a sprayable finish cut. Okay. And then the, the heavy cut will be named Smoky Red. Dude. All right. I don't know where you come up with those names. Huh? I don't know either. I don't know. It sounds it's familiar. A, it's original. Yeah. No copyrights. Oh, this is great because I see all the spots on my stacks up there. 
This will be good. Well, it's just a little extra reach, you know. Yeah. I mean, instead of carrying a ladder around. Yes. <laughs> which I have to get out a ladder, and I'm terrible on a ladder. I mean, Mid on a is, stick, Chemex.com. This, this is all right, you know. It definitely gets the job done. So when you gotta get up high with it, I just spray the yeah. head itself, get it soaked up a little bit. And the sun is kind of helping us today because Ooh, we can see the spots. Yeah, you can see it. Uh, I oh, almost yeah. feel like it loosens up. And you don't spots. have to wipe it off afterwards. That's well, what. I, yeah, I mean, it's kind of like you don't have to buff it out. At a certain point, the the material will be too saturated, and then it might get a little yeah, runny looking. You know that, how that yeah. is. That's kind of yeah. the norm. But you know, when you first start off and you have a fresh pad on the thing, it'll yep. get it done pretty nice. Now, was the awesome sauce just for aluminum and stainless? No, no, no. It's for glass, paint, everything. Paint too. Yeah. Wow. So it, what does it have any like polymers in it? Yeah, it's SiO2. So oh, it's you know, I know the word polymers from you. Yeah, that's like an older SiO2. Okay. <laughs> it's like a the older buzzword. Oh yeah. The marketing changes over time and it's little tweaks on the chemical yeah. level, but polymers kind of turned into SiO2s from what I understand. This one's SiO2 technically is what we aimed at there. You know, if this whole uh, Chemex uh, soap wash thing doesn't work out for you, you got a you got a future in detail in trucks. Nah. I am not. A, I keep telling people I'm not a detailer, bro. I'm just trying to figure out what works and how to save time and make things easier, you know? Yeah, you do. You're the trucker's friend. Bob Hoyle. Chemex. Let's get the visor, bro. Hell yeah. I don't know if it needs it. Oh, you're right. I just, I did it this morning. Let's get I... the mirror. Yes, sir. Dude, I'm, I'm excited to get my, my hands on this thing. This I'm is so happy. Right. You know, you've offered me many times to come down and get my truck washed, but I like I tell you, it's oh. never that dirty. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know, I, I do like to, I do prefer to get dirty trucks in. Yeah, I would really, it's, I, it's I not, don't think I could keep mine dirty that long is the problem. <laughs> gonna, will you do me a favor and hold on to yeah. that for me? I don't want to lay it on your Buddy truck. McDermott, how you doing, my friend? Uh, thanks. How are you? Nice to see you. Oh, thank you so much. Appreciate that. Where'd you get this from? Oh, those are good people. Those are friends of mine. Oh, yeah. Thank yeah, you. I said, you know, I said, would I go with a red Kenworth? Well, I don't know what the Kenworth look like. That one there. Oh, Mike's? So That's you, funny. She said, yeah. That's funny. Oh, getting them spot mirrors, man. Well, you know, we need more, though. I don't, I'm not quite getting it done with this. You stuff. know, I washed this truck for the first time yesterday. Yeah. And uh, I was kind of in a hurry to get home for dinner. It was kind of, I was running late. Family Things were running late. First. Family first. Family first. Dude, I'm in the middle of washing my truck for gear jam, <laughs> and my daughter calls me. Dad, I'm at camp. I have a headache. Can you come pick me up and bring me home? I'm like... It's a real headache, not a fake headache, right? Because I'm about to wash my truck, and it's 4 o'clock, and I want to be home by 6. No, Dad, come and get me. Drop everything. Bring How go. Far away is the camp? 20 minutes away, 20 minutes back home, back to work. I did it. At rush hour. At rush hour. It wasn't, it wasn't too bad. Hi, Cindy. How are you? Good. I love your hat. Thank you for the towel. It's really nice of you. We're just doing, getting a demonstration here from Bob Hoyle at Chemex. Nah, it's not a demonstration. Chemex.com, <laughs> Chemex, Chemex on YouTube. I was just rolling around. I, was, I, I love it. I brought this around with me just it. to see if we could tune anybody up. No, I love it, yes. I've been trying to get Mike over to my place. I got a wash bay over right outside here. the Berkshires in Western Mass. Oh, yeah. And uh, we've been trying to get together for a while. we got to make it happen, man. Sometimes. Well, you soon. got some good customers now. Oh, you're, man, you ain't kidding. You're like worldwide I now. wish I knew who everybody was. I just... It's too busy. I remember when you were driving around in a pickup truck delivering yeah. drums of soap. <laughs> yeah, I remember that. <laughs> Those were good days, though. Yeah. You know, it was really yeah. nice. I got to travel around see I gotta everybody try the in their shop. The polish, yeah. I just noticed this tarnish here. Yeah, look at that. You need some polish. I think I need Let's some polish. Let's go fix that up. Keep yeah. this stuff here. I'll, just, okay. I'll be right back. Let me get some of okay. that polish for you. All right. What do we got there, Bob? Bandit Blue, bro. Bandit Blue Experimental Aluminum Polish? Yes, sir. Finish cut, sprayable and everything. Can I trust you? No. I think I can trust you. No, no, no. no, no. You're, you're a mad scientist. Small, small spots only. Try it in small spots. Okay. We'll see what happens, you know. We need a rag, though. Did, did Chris give you a roll of rags yeah. already? Uh, no. No? No. I wish Chris. get a roll of rags. Okay. All right, let me go get that. I'll okay. Be Good thing we're close and I got scooters. Yeah, scooters are helpful. So that's going to be an interesting solution because that's where we can help a little bit. Yeah, it's like tarnish. Like yeah, I didn't yeah. Even, I've never noticed it. Yeah. Bad. Yeah. Like I, we need to feel like something's shaking up. So, I'll be around. All right, right guys. Nice. You're gonna love these, man. Roller, I, I, I'm already love them. I have a feeling you like them. Plus, they're your color. Yes. Check it out. Oh, nice. Let me feel that. Yeah, 260 GSM. 
What does GSM mean? Uh, I don't know. It's, it's like really <laughs> Sounded gallons, important though. Yeah. Gallons suck per minute. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, yeah. gallons soak. Yeah. Yeah. We'll go with that. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I think it, well, it's, it's what it is is the density of the weave here, and the higher the number, the better. Yeah. So you want to get, uh, you want to get for paint, you want to get up into the higher GSMs. Okay. The, the lower GSMs are better for like things like polishing aluminum. I think mm -hmm. would be helpful. Okay. You know, here, throw this in your backpack. So anyways, let's see what we can do here. Yeah. Do you see how good the awesome sauce came out in the, in the tire shine on the Kenworth? Oh, yeah. I see that. Very good job. Yeah. He's hired. <laughs> yeah, I would say so. All right, let's get a little bit on here. Let's try not to get any overspray. This, yeah. stuff, this stuff's pretty blue. <laughs> so this is Blue Bandit. Oh, yeah. my God. It's pretty blue. Look, my, look, I shut my door here. There we go. Anyway. I don't know where that tarnish came from. I don't know, but we'll get it. It's already gone. That's not too bad. Is it really? Yeah. I don't think so. Now we got it. Yeah, there we go. So how's your YouTube channel doing? What are you guys doing on there? Uh, we're just kind of washing things. You know, hopefully the dirtier the better. Yeah. I always look for things that need the help. This is no different than a normal polish, right? You yep. get a little bit of the oxidation coming out and that, that black stuff on the rag there. Mm -hmm. so well, you want, to see, you want to see black. Yeah. And you know, pretty quick and easy. You flip over to an area yep. that's not got it on there and buff it down. Probably would help to let it kind of air dry, air dry a little, a little bit, bit yeah, but yeah. you know, if we're in a hurry like now, we just get yep. it done anyway and yep. flip it around to another section. And anyway, you can hold on to all this stuff here. You, I need I need beta testers. I've been telling okay. people I need beta testers. So just let me know how you like it. You I know? will, yeah, absolutely. Anyway, it's a little better. Oh, it's still got a little spot there. Yep. So, you know, it needs a little more elbow grease right there, but in general, that got Yeah, that came off nice. I can tell, definitely yeah. see the difference. But you can see where I'll it finish hitting it, yeah. You, you would benefit from it on the whole thing. You yeah. Know what I mean, like up here, yeah. you know, in little spots like on the chrome, the, the awesome yeah. sauce wasn't enough to get that. Okay. And that's why I wanted something that was a yeah. little more, yeah. you know, helpful. So I think you'll like it, uh, you know. So know. You, you say I could use this on my truck without having any worries? I don't think you'll have any trouble, okay. though. It's like yeah. it always diamond plate I want to hit. See all the yeah. diamond plate back yeah. here? Uh, I mean, there's, there's, it's hard to have issues with polish. Yeah. I think, in my opinion, anyway. But that's, uh, that's all going to clean up pretty easy. I don't think you'll have yeah. any trouble on that. And the diamond plate looks pretty good. Yeah. Diamond plate's such a pain to polish, isn't it? But it, yeah, it is. But it holds up for standing. Yeah. True. I don't have to, you know. Yeah. So that's why I got the diamond plate. Man, this is nice to have a fresh truck, right? Yeah. You must be so excited about. I haven't this. had a fresh truck since '96, so. Whoa. The first one in a long time. Whoa, that's how many years is that? It's a lot like... of years. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Well, I'm excited. I'm excited man. about it. You thank you. It. You've thank you very the, much. You've been pushing hard for a lot of years. You've got great work ethic. Yeah. Thank so you. I'm hey, just like you, it. man. Man. You got to have that ethic, right? You have to. Yeah. Well, you know, you do it for the right. You do it because you love it. You yeah. Know what I mean, that's what's cool about what you're you doing. You still like the business? Energy. What's you still that? Love, you still love the business? Yeah. It's been a struggle here yeah. and there as it grows and there's problems and, you know, you need more people. How many people are working for you now? We have 12 now. Wow. Which is like small. We're still small, but yeah. it's big enough to be like a nightmare, you know? Like, sure. But as people get situated, then, it, you know, it's getting a lot better. So. You ever take a break? I need a break. I need one. You need but a vacation. I don't know if I, you know. I went down to a, uh, a car wash convention in Nashville for a break recently. Yeah. It was like, I love what we oh, do. Oh, nice. And like, it was actually for my 40th birthday. I went yeah. down there. And it was, uh, it was nice to get out of town for a little bit. You know, I still had some problems haunt me that came through anyway, right, but right, like, right. you know, I'm the chief uh, fire and flood officer. What are yeah, you going to do? What are you going to so, do? Yeah. It all <laughs> but, rolls down to you. Yeah. But you know, we're getting better and better and the team's really confident. I got a lot of great people on my team now. That's so key. Good spot. People you can trust. Yeah. People I can trust who are, you know, they're good at what they need to do and what they need to be good at and, uh, and everything's coming together. So I think well, we have awesome. a good foundation. And really the goal with that is just to keep me free to make videos because I really yep. want to focus on our YouTube channel. Your channel is pretty awesome. So, thank you. I watch I it on it. Sunday nights when I'm doing yeah. laundry. <laughs> yeah. It's good because I, uh, I can listen to it and fold fold uh, underwear at the same time. That's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah I, I make them long on purpose just because yeah. I like to have stuff on in the background. Yeah. So like I know that, you know, sometimes you just want to put something on yeah. and just see something happen over time. Yeah. And, you know. You're very, you're, yeah. you're very uh, technically advanced. More than, I'm doing everything on my phone still. <laughs> So I can learn a few things great, from you. You have but, great videos. Well, oh, thanks, man. Channel, and, uh, well, Bob, thanks yeah. for coming by. Thanks for uh, 
Yeah. Letting me experiment with some of your stuff. The awesome sauce here. I hope you like it. The blue bandit coming to a store near you, to the Chemex.com yeah. near you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I the think of, uh, enjoy those. Thank play you so with much. Them. And the mitt. Yep. Hook yourself up there with thank some you. stuff, man. All Great right. To see you again. Boston Trucker awesome with Bob Hoyle. <laughs> right, Thanks, guys. Care, thank you. Awesome to All see right, you. All right, man.